Engine failures, whether during the day or at night, are at the top of a pilot's I hope this never happens to me list. However, if this does happen, pilots need to be prepared. There are two fundamental factors to keep in mind during emergencies. Number one, problems accumulate exponentially. The sum of the problems usually ends up being greater than the whole. And number two, indecision creates anxiety. Good decisions are rarely made in an anxious state. Being prepared and staying ahead of the airplane and your situation are key. In some cases, pilots may spend unnecessary time and lose precious altitude while going through the checklist. To the best of your ability, have the engine out checklist memorized and stick with your original decision. Although this pilot was high on final, she was lined up with a 9,500 foot runway, leaving plenty of room for a steady slip that would have reduced the altitude needed. Instead, the decision was made to change runways at the last minute, unknowingly turning directly into several clouds at night with no engine. Not being an instrument rated pilot, this decision made a bad situation exponentially worse. Now we have a pilot that can't see, is disoriented, anxious, stressed, and instead of being lined up for a long runway and too high, she may be too low and hoping for a runway to appear below her. It worked out in this simulation. As a pilot, you have to ask yourself, was this the best decision? It is often the best decision to stick with your first decision and work the problem from there. In all emergencies, remaining calm and free of anxiety will allow you to make good aeronautical decisions. Good decisions that hopefully will lead to good outcomes and good stories to tell.